Hello? Hello? Now I'm going to tell you how to turn your iPod Touch 4G into a iOS 6 version. To prove it's an iPod, look. iPod. Hmm. So first, go into Cydia. This goes to manage, sources, edit, and add. Add this source. Cydia.xlize.com slash and add it. So then you need to find iFile. There is there. Okay. So you have to install that, and you ma you have to respring manually. I'll see you after I've installed it. Hello. After you installed that, go into iFile. And go back to the slash. You need to go into applications, mobile phone dot app, and go down to the icons. Okay. Once you see that, you open the one with small in it, and you copy it. Copy the text. Now you need to delete everything which has FaceTime in it. Okay. So you need to paste that. Go on to the other one. Paste that but change the S to a small S. Okay? And you have to respring, so I'll see you after I respring. Okay, and now you can see the FaceTime icon has changed to the phone icon. So next, go into iFile and go into the mobile phone dot app. Go to engb.iproj. Go to info p list. And then you need to change FaceTime to phone. Save and done. Okay, next go into English.ipod. Go to info.plist and text you. Change the FaceTime to phone. <coughs> so and next you have to go into info.plist open it in text viewer and you'll see cf bundle display name this kind of dash thing ipod you need to change facetime underneath it to phone save and done and i'll see you after i've respawn okay so i Resprung and look, it's changed to the phone icon. So now you need to get it so it actually opens in the phone display. Let's go into iFile, go back to the slash, go to system, library, call services, springboard.app. Now go to n81ap.plist That one. This one here. Now open it in text viewer and underneath the second dict you need to add this key. Key 
telephony slash key true slash key we have to leave line after that s m s no capitals slash key through save and done I'll see you after I've respawn okay so I've respawn so now go into the phone and you'll see keypad there okay click on that and look you've got the keypad So next is to get the camera features for the flash and the fake HDR. These do not work but it's quite good. Okay, so go into iFile. Go into n81ap.plist again. Edit only for second dip like last time. Add this key key camera dash lash slash key. True key HDR no capitals dash image dash capture and then slash key then true slash press save and done and I'll see you after I respawn okay so to check it go into camera then you'll see the flash at the top it will be on auto it doesn't actually work um, you've got HDR there which doesn't work. Okay, so next is to get Siri. Okay, so go into Cydia. Just wait for it to load. You to manage sources, edit and add. Add this source. Repo dot Siri port dot argue. And I'll see you after you've added the source. And I. Okay, next, open the Siri port and you'll find Siri port original iOS 6 okay it says on there better original Apple Siri for iOS 6 iPhone 4 GSM slash CDM a iPhone touch 4 like I've got 
others not tested install with caution okay so install that one and now for you there I've installed you will also have to boot tethered as well so prepare for that okay so you'll respring but it tells you to reboot so it looks like it's working because if you go into settings and go to the bottom you'll see the Siri port but it isn't okay so you need to reboot I'll see you after I've rebooted okay I'm rebooted. so next once you after you've rebooted go into settings SiriPort.ru original and install, install certificate it will go into your browser so you need to be connected to the internet okay. you press install certificate <coughs> press ok it will go into your settings app and press install install and done and to check you've installed the open settings you'll find profile and siriport.ru okay so next you need to catch the key that might take a while so i'll see you after i've catched it okay i found the key so to test it out just hi See? That is how you turn your iPod Touch into a f into an iPod. Goodbye.